back to Cheap Lazy Begin. Today we have a taste test video. It has been forever and a half since I've done one of these taste test videos. Here we have a vegan cuts box. Yes, so excited. I literally have two more boxes to taste test because I just have not been doing these videos. I don't really even have an excuse to be honest because these are actually really easy to film so I don't know why. Supposedly it's literally from like May. So sorry vegan cuts. I forgot about you, but I'm here and we're gonna taste it. I did chop off my hair, if you've noticed. It is quite short. This is the shortest I've had my hair for a very, very long time. I used to have like a bob, but that was like almost 10 years ago, okay. So it is pretty short, but I'm happy with it because it was so damaged. That's mainly why I chopped it off because the ends were just, it was not cute. I'm just gonna get straight into this taste test. If you are not aware of vegan cuts, Ooh. They are essentially a vegan snack box subscription service. So essentially you sign up and you can get one of these delivered to your home every month and it's full of completely vegan snacks. And I actually met the founder or one of the founders of Vegan Cuts uh, randomly when I was in Toronto at the Toronto Vegan Food and Drink Festival. That was pretty sweet. So this is like a very old box. So if you follow these videos, you've probably already seen it. But here it is, yes, yes, yes. So, oh my word, some of this stuff sounds interesting. Ooh, okay. Let's get started with the taste test. Okay, so the first product I have here, these are Pop Chips Potato Ridges. Uh, salted, never fried, always real, popped chip snack. So, so, they look like that. It looks pretty good. Hmm. It has a nice crunch. It's quite thick, salty. It's pretty good. Um, I think I would prefer it with some more like different, like a different flavor, you know. But oh, pretty good. Mmm. Very savory. Seven point five out of ten. Oh, let's see here. Okay, well, I'll show you another thing that there is. <laughs> Apparently, I have some sort of rice thing. Cajun jambalaya. So this is a jambalaya mix, sample size. And I guess you just cook this. Um, but I'm not gonna cook it today because, I don't know, I'm just kinda lazy. Should I cook it? <sighs> So normally if you guys watch these taste test videos, you know I like to go like salty sweet, salty sweet. So let's pick a sweet. Okay, this one is mocha latte coffee bar. And it looks like this. And it's called Eat Your Coffee. Apparently there's a cup of coffee in every bar. A little concerning because I've already had like two cups of coffee today. And it's kind of late right now. It's not, it's definitely not early. But I'll just have a little bit. It looks like this. Looks like just a protein bar or something. I'm awake. It is very strong in coffee flavor. Ooh, there's chocolate chips in it. I mean, it just tastes very strongly of coffee. I like coffee. Mm. Seven out of 10, I don't know. Maybe I just prefer to drink coffee. <laughs> okay, so I think I know what these taste like. I'm pretty sure I've had these before. Um, these are Peas Please Garden Herb Baked Organic Crunchy Pea Snack. Yeah, I've definitely had these before. Mm. Love these, so good. The flavor on it is so good. Mmm, num num. Yeah, I could eat. I could eat this whole thing right now. Nine out of ten. Okay, I feel like you can't go wrong with this one. So this is so simple. From soul to soul. Do you see this? From soul to soul. 
How cute. The solar dried organic mangoes. So there's nothing added. So I feel like it's just a nice healthy mango snack. Okay. So there's quite a bit packed in there. Like it's pretty densely packed, which is good. It smells like mango. Mmm. I'm digging this. It's just such a nice, healthy, not overly sweet snack. I love mangoes. Mm hmm Really good. It's dried fruit. What can I say? 10 out of 10. Okay, so I'm going to do another um, savory. This one is apparently seen on Shark Tank. What? Popcorn cheddar flavor. Delicious mini popcorn. 81 calories per bag. Popped in the USA. Okay. So, cheddar. The bag is interesting. It's like paper. And apparently this is the original size, which is good. I need to eat like a substantial amount to understand this. Mm. Nice cheesy flavor. It's not super greasy, which I like. Good. Eight out of ten. I can't stop. <laughs> this is the problem with popcorn. You can never stop with popcorn. It's like you can't stop. I wish the pieces were bigger though. Like, each piece is like this big. You know? It's annoying. Like, it should be bigger. They're all broken up. Mm. They also have some teas, which I may have later tonight. These are like some nice little organic caffeine free teas. We've got cooling ashwanga and turmeric blend. We also have ginger and turmeric blend. So. I do love me some teas. And I've actually had this before. And it was actually quite good. Instant oatmeal. And um, it's very good. It's actually quite nice and pretty sweet. Pretty delicious. And the flavor is strawberry shortcake. Delicious. Especially for instant oatmeal. I think it's quite good. Whew. So shake, shake, shake. Is that what it says? Zumba, shake, shake, shake. It's all good. <laughs> What's with this name? It's called Zumba Shake, and it's basically like a mocha shake, I guess. It says, mix entire contents of package with 10 fluid ounces of cold water or milk. We prefer almond milk, it says. For the best taste, add a handful of ice and mix in a blender until creamy for a milkshake consistency. Best consumed within 30 minutes. All right, this is pretty good, you guys, actually. It's like kind of like a protein powder, it looks like, because it was like, for the package, it was 16 grams of protein, which is pretty good. It's a little bit, you know, slightly has that gritty protein powder texture, but it's not super gritty. I added like half a banana, frozen banana in here. It was almond milk, half a frozen banana, and then the mix, and it's actually quite good. It's quite good. All right, next I have organic hazelnut spread, 40% less sugar than the leading brand. This is by Nutiba. I've definitely had this before, but I will try it again for research purposes. Okay, let's just give it a go. I like this package, how, ooh, look at that. Look at the chocolate, oh my word. This one's dark chocolate, I guess, with hazelnut. Yeah, me. It's definitely less sweet than Nutella from what I remember anyway. And like, it definitely tastes like dark chocolate. It's yummy. Um, I would say that hazelnut taste isn't as strong and I would prefer a, a more stronger hazelnut taste. I'll give it an eight still because it's still chocolatey and it's still delicious, so. Eight out of 10. Ugo bars or Yugo bars, whatever these are called. And another sweet and salty snack bar so let's give it a go looks like that
Mm hmm Yep. It's good. I actually wasn't even expecting that much, but oh my god, this is actually really good. The peanuts. There's like probably dates in there, I think. Or raisins, it says. Mmm. Really good. Especially for like something so natural. With like really good natural ingredients. I'm gonna give this an 8.5 out of 10. I like it. Okay, now we're gonna try all natural peanut butter chewy ginger candy. What is my life? How do I open this? No, why won't you open? Oh my god. All right, we're gonna try this Reed's all natural peanut butter chewy ginger candy. This, I really like this packaging. And it looks like this, it looks like really old school, like candy packaging, which I like. And I like that they are individually packaged. So, it looks like that, and it's kind of squishy. What the mother of crap? Mm. Okay, so in the beginning it was a bit strange like it was quite chewy and like weird texture But then it just got a little bit better as it melted in your mouth and Yeah, it's actually quite good. Um, the ginger flavor is not super strong. So that's nice uh, The peanut butter. Yeah, it's just it's a nice little treat. Actually. I really I actually really like it I wasn't sure in the beginning at first. I was like, what is this stuff? But then as it progressed it created a very nice taste it's not super sweet it's actually quite nice it's a nice little snack i want to say maybe like eight out of ten maybe 7.5 we'll see somewhere in between all right well that's it that is finally my vegan cuts taste test i know it's been a very long time and this is a very old box but better late than never that's my motto anyways i really hope you guys like this video if you guys want to see more videos like this let me know down below what you guys think of these taste test videos i know they're different from recipe videos but i just can't do recipe videos all the time okay thank you guys for watching give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it of course don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already hit the notification bell if you want to not miss any videos in the future and i'll see you guys in my next video bye